Well, that was kind of some comeback. Yeah, it was interesting. Um, of course, we we didn't give up uh, until the end. I was to come back from 2 0 down, but we made it harder for ourselves. I think uh, we didn't really turn up in the first half. We showed them too much respect. Um, we weren't really at the races, uh, but of course, you know, we showed um, desire to come back from 2 0 and of course, you know, to get a point. But we should personally, um, and we know as, as a team and, and the gaffer knows, we should be getting three points. You're Matty Dolan, super subs. Yeah, no, nah, it's good. Of course, you know, it's always good to have you know players who can come on and change the game. Of course, you know, I've gone from uh, being out for a long time from injury. Um, and uh, coming back, playing uh, quite a lot of minutes, so you know it was right for me to to rest and then uh, not to overdo it. But of course, you know coming in as well, you know making the impact straight away, and of course happy to to get the, the equaliser. Yeah, I've got a few goals under your belt now, and you must think I've got to make up for lost time after that injury. Huh? Um, yeah, I mean every game I just go out, just enjoy it, play play my game. Um, I don't tend to put too much pressure on myself. Uh, that's when you start. Uh, not being yourself, I just want to go out there, uh, give it my all every game, and and just you know put a smile on the fans really. Uh, and of course, I love scoring goals. That's what I've come here to do. And uh, it's good to you know start the year with another goal and and just to kind of keep you know keep keep going with, with where I left off in the last year. But um, yeah, I've got my own goals. I've got my own you know targets which I want to achieve before the end of the season. So I guess every game is just another challenge. But then I can obviously you know go out and just pre- you know perform to the best I can. Uh, and do you feel 100% now, fitness-wise? Yeah, yeah, of course. You know, as I've said, you know I've been out for a long time. Unfortunately, obviously with football injury, you know it happens. Um, but. You know, with training and uh, the minutes which I've been getting on, under my belt is has helped massively um, to be able to, to come on and make an impact like tonight, uh, today. Sorry, sorry, sorry. And even you know playing on um, Friday. Um, so there's been loads of games uh, back and forth. Of course, you know the busy schedule, but um, but yes, yeah, it's, it's good. You know, I'm getting the minutes in my legs, and I'm just you know happy to be back amongst the team and helping where I can. Really. What has Graham Coughlin said to you? Well. For me personally, you know, just to come on to make a make an impact, to change the game, add a bit of uh, energy to the game, uh, and that's just basically be myself. What I, what I tend to do anyway when I come on, uh, run around, um, put defenders, you know, on the back foot, put them under pressure, and of course, you know, if he in front of goal, get a shot off, and um, and link up play really, and be a nuisance really, in, um, going forward and, and and holding up the ball. So. Just basically my game, uh, helping the team where I can, and of course it was good to come back from 2-0 um, to get up to get a point. But it felt more of a a loss for us because we should have won uh, on personal terms. But it's better than you know no point. So I guess obviously we have to just regroup, um, look back at it, and, and and improve. Yeah, no, you play another side below you on Saturday, Rochdale. Doesn't need any building up that one, does it? No, I mean Rochdale. Every game is a big game. Uh, like today, it's, it's proven. You know, it doesn't matter really where you are in the league. Um, anyone can beat anyone. Um, and you know, if you're not careful, like today, it could have slipped out. You know, out of our hands. And Rochdale, that'd be another challenge. Um, different team, different setup, uh, different players, of course. And it's another challenge to go out. You know, perform, put up performance, um, and start climbing the table as much as we can. Really, we we can't be affording to. Uh, Keep dropping off points where we can. You know, we've 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 worked hard to be to be where we are at this moment in time. Um, and yeah, we just need to start obviously picking up the points in in, in the in, in the league. So that's important. Yeah, because uh, you've got a good cushion now. But if you were to to get a win at Rochdale, yeah, that would really set you up and maybe start looking upwards. Then. Yeah, of course. That's what I mean. The 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 league can change massively very quickly. Uh, there's not that many points between. Where we are and uh, playoffs position, so I think it's important for us to go into every game focused and uh, determined to win um, our individual battles, and I've come of, and of course you know come away with three points. Um, it's easier said than done, of course. Um, you have to get yourself up, you have to get yourself ready, you have to match the tempo, early doors, and you know it's another challenge. But this is what you play football for. You know you challenge yourself against different players and be the best you. And you know and that's where you see characters in the league, in the team and, and winners. You know, no one will be here if they didn't want to win games. So we all got the same mentality. So I think we just need to regroup, uh, get our heads up, and go again on Saturday. Crew, crew was a winner, but this one was in front of your own fans. Which, which do you, which, which, which do you prefer? Uh, uh, obviously, a mix. Uh, crew, obviously, I was there, played uh, for half a season, um, and of course, here, I mean, 
I think it's my first goal scoring here, so yeah. it's uh, it was a good feeling. Of course, it would have been better if it was the winner, uh, but we still was chasing the game even at that time. So, but it's good to you know to give something back to the fans um, and the fans I appreciate obviously the support which they've given me through my injury and since I've come back and the belief really which is important um, as a player to know that I've still got the backing of the fans and the fans enjoy when I come on the pitch and, and I just want to play uh, and put a smile on their, on their faces and of course it's good to, to get that equaliser today and celebrate. Do you feel as a squad you, you need a break? It is tough the, 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 the schedule and Graham alluded to the fact he felt it was a bit of a leggy performance. Do you feel as a squad you need a bit of a... I mean that's where a... that's where obviously the staffs will have to look and see where we can improve, us as players, see where we can improve as well as players, how we feel, communicate that to them. Um, but most importantly, you know, we're a team, you know, we're, we're, we're in it together, you know, there's, there's the staffs are in it together, the players are in it together and we all want to do well. The staffs push us every day, we push each other. Um, and we want the best for each other, you know. As I've said, we're all winners. We want to win. We want to climb up the table. Everyone wants success. So, I think everyone's got the right mindset. And I think I'm sure, you know, with the game coming up on Saturday, Rochdale, uh, we will we'll regroup and we'll do well. And you know, and three points is the only thing which is on our mind and should be anyway. In terms of that sort of fighting spirit, it's always been here at this club. How much do the likes of Mickey, Matty Dolan, and even Mark O'Brien, David Pipe? sort of stress that side of things, the demands of you as players at the new... Well, that's, that's of course, you know, players that have come this year, like myself, um, there's, um, you know, there's a foundation which has been set at this club, uh, the standards, um, players that, like you've mentioned, which have played at this club or still playing, uh, which have represented the badge. Uh, it's important for players to come here, to know what they give, what they have to do as a job uh, for the team, for the club, um, at the end of the day. There's loads of fans that come and watch us play week in, week out, uh, sacrifice their time, money, to buy tickets and come and watch. So the least that we can do is work hard um, and give back to them with our you know, attitude, work rate. And of course, ability, you can, you're can. you not always going to have ability. Some players are not, some players more than others. But work rate, I think, with the standards which has been set and which is always going to be rising uh, in the in the changing rooms, it's important for us to, to keep challenging that and keep climbing. When David Park tells you to work hard, you work hard. <laughs> <laughs> if, if, if he tells you to do anything, I think everyone would do that. Uh, but he's a good, he's a good, uh, he's a good guy since he's come in. Uh, he's helped us massively uh, on the strengthening side and SSC side, uh, alongside with Nathan as well. Um, and it's just you know getting the team stronger from backroom staffs to the players. As much as we can get better, that's important. So we can kick on to do well in the league uh, individually and as a team as well. All good. Great.